You can use any script editor to create PHP pages, but I'm using Dreamweaver CS55, not only because it's my favourite web development tool, but also because it has excellent built-in support for PHP. A really cool feature is the way it's into your testing server, allowing you to test PHP pages directly in the document window. In this video, I'll show how to set up a Dreamweaver PHP site. Of course, if you're not using Dreamweaver, you can skip this lesson completely. Dreamweaver is a site-based tool, so you need to define a site for the workshop. So go to Site, New Site, and then give the site a name. Introducing PHP. doesn't matter if there are spaces in there. This is the name that will be shown in the Dreamweaver Files panel. And then for Local Site Folder, you need to navigate to your server root which in my case is in XAMPP, htdocs, and then select Introducing PHP. Of course, if you're using MAMP, you need to navigate to the MAMP server route. Just select that, and then set up the server. Select Servers from here, and click the plus button to add a new server. Give the server a name which I'll call testing server and then connect using local network then select the server folder this is the same as your site folder so it's introducing PHP I just select that on Windows Dreamweaver automatically selects the same folder as your local site folder but on a Mac you do need to navigate directly to the folder again. And then the web URL is localhost slash introducing PHP slash. Now don't forget that if you're using a non-standard port after localhost you need to add colon followed by the port number but if you're just using the default port that's all you need to do. So select the advanced tab and deselect maintain synchronization information. You don't need this. And just click yes to confirm. And then the server model, select PHP MySQL and save. Dreamweaver automatically selects the remote checkbox. Deselect that and select testing and save. And that's all there is to setting up a PHP site in Dreamweaver. Just to show you how useful the uh, live view is, I'm going to open this config.php file, which has got the PHP info command in there, and go into split view, so you can see the document window on the right-hand side, and then go into live view, and you can see that it shows you exactly the same as you would see in a browser. So what Dreamweaver is doing is it's connecting directly with the testing server. The server is parsing the PHP and then displaying it in Dreamweaver's document window, which is extremely useful. Of course, the testing server must be running, so if you didn't get the uh, configuration page shown like this, check that the server is running and everything should be okay. So now Dreamweaver is set up to work throughout the rest of the workshop.